Hey guys, so this is my Summer Waves Elite. It's a 14 foot by 42 inch deep pool. I've had this up for a few weeks. I've done a few videos on this and unboxing and had a level of ground. What I'm going to do is uh, show you what I do for my uh, usually a daily maintenance. As you can see, the uh, water's still nice and crystal clear. The first thing you want to do is make sure that your filter area is nice and clean. So I cleaned this earlier today. And as you can see, there's a little bit of debris in here. So what I'll do is I'll turn the pump off and I'll actually uh, pull out this screen and pull out the filter. And I clean the filter on a daily basis. So to take out the filter, it's just as easy as pulling on the screen. And as you can see, you want to keep this screen nice and clean. This usually collects the uh, larger debris. So I have my garden hose here. So what I usually do is spray inside there. And you can actually see the uh, dirt coming out of the filter. And it's a lot of the uh, fine debris that will kind of get stuck in it. So what I'll do is I'll spray all around on the inside of the filter. Then I'll flip it over and do this end. And it's amazing how much will come out of here. If, if I don't clean this after a few days, this will start to get quite brown on the element. And then again, I'll spray the outside of the filter and get a lot of the uh, larger debris that's caught. Rolls away on me. A little easier with two hands. But I'll spray the uh, outside of the filter and you want to get all this uh, larger debris that gets trapped in the elements out. All right, so I got the filter all uh, cleaned out. So to reinstall it, just put it in, give it a little push down when it's in the center. And you'll know when it's in, it will kind of, almost feels like it locks in and will float up. Step is to put in your screen. And this actually uh, clicks down on the uh, top of the filter. You just reinstall the top and this just slides in and I'll uh, turn on the pool pump. Alright, so the pool pump's on. So what I use for chemicals is the Shocket. Now I actually purchased this uh, kit at Costco today. And this is pretty much just chlorine. And what it comes in is 12 packages. Now it's 454 grams in each package. So I'll usually put about one of those in a week. Get away with one package a week. Uh, this was actually sit up, filled up with our city water. Now our city water does have chlorine and it is filtered so it's quite clean and excellent drinking water. So it's not hard and you don't get a lot of brown like the well water with uh, minerals and whatnot in it. Now typically what I'll do with my chemicals is I'll put some in my hand now you should probably wear gloves because of the chlorine and what I'll do is I'll kind of take it and throw it on top of the water with the pump running and what that do will do is it will spread it out throughout the pool now what I'll do is I'll probably take about 10 handfuls and I'll give it a little throw just so it's pretty much covering the uh, top of the pool and what that will do with the pump, it will work in throughout the uh, water. And when you do that, you don't want to swim right away. You want the uh, chlorine to get diluted by the water before you get into the pool. So I usually wait about an hour or two for it to thoroughly get through the pool. So again, I've done a few videos on this pool. So this is the only thing I've used. And so far, my uh, pool water stays crystal clean. And again, I think that's contributed with the uh, good water that was put in it initially and always cleaning the filter on a daily basis. Again, it takes about probably a minute to take the filter out and clean it. So again, I can get away with typically one package of that a week. And again, this is a 14 foot pool. Big ball, but what I do every night is I make sure the pool is covered. So I'll cover it at night time and usually uncover it in the morning and let the sun get to it. 
but this keeps a lot of the uh, bugs and debris out of the pool. And last but not least, the old pool scoop. So I'll usually go along the top of the pool, scoop out any bugs or grass, and also you want to make sure if you get any debris at the bottom of the pool, you want to make sure you get all that scooped out. And the way I do it is I'll kind of go along like that and it will kind of get the debris floating in the bottom of the pool and then you'll be able to scoop it out. And you want to make sure you scoop out any debris. If not, it's going to start rotting and settling in the bottom of your pool. And I do have a tree hanging right above my pool so I do get a fair amount of debris from that coming in so I always want to make sure it's scooped out. So again, all I do every day is I'll scoop out any debris. I uh, clean my pool filter and again this is st still the original one and I believe this is a C for the model for the pool filter. So I'll make sure that's cleaned out every day. I scoop out any debris and I put the uh, chlorine in which is the shock it uh, usually once a week. I might even do it twice a week and just use half a bag each time. And again as you can see the pools nice and crystal clear and again I also uh, cover it every night. Anyways guys just a short video on what I do to maintain the pool. I've had a few people asking. If you have any questions or comments post them below. If not thanks for watching and uh, you may want to consider subscribing to the channel to uh, get any further updates on this pool as well as a lot of other videos I have uh, posted on the channel. Thanks for watching.